what I came to encourage you to know tonight is that God has chosen you, specifically you, for the assignment to which you have been called. And I am a living witness of what can happen when one person never gives up on what they see. Jesus doesn't love you just because you're in ministry. No, no, he loves you because you are a son and a daughter of the most high God. He died for you, he went to the cross for you, and he rose from the grave for you. Let me tell you about a lamb. They marched him up a hill called Calvary. They hung him high, they stretched him wide. He bowed his head and for me he died. But all this Sunday morning, he got up with all power to let us know he has resurrection power. So if you need a God who's got resurrection power in your life, all you ought to give him some praise because every great gift deserves a great response. You ought to thank him because he brought us together. We're supposed to be together. We're supposed to work together. We're supposed to love together. We're supposed to collaborate together. We're supposed to network together. We're supposed to support together. We're supposed to change the world together. We're supposed to disturb the fake peace to bring the peace together. How you work together can change how a generation sees God. <laughs>